Okay, I'm heading to the post office. Everything for the family is in here. And when I get there, I'm going to have to fill out individual packets to mail them to all different places. So, uh, I'm going to get the kids first, drop them off here at home, and then head back out. Okay, I'm just cooking up some dinner. It took forever at the post office. So, these are some yummy chicken fritters from Zacon Fresh. And now I'm going to top them with some sauce. And I'm going to use bertoli and top them with cheese. I have some saute green beans going on over here. And I'm going to make something else. Not sure what yet, but I'm going to make something else. So we are hurrying to have dinner. Okay, I'm going to get this back in the oven just until the cheese is all melted. Yummy, yummy. Dinner is ready. Yum. Well, we are at Walmart tonight as a family for family home evening. And we're working on a really fun project for hashtag light the world. It's a special service project our family is doing. Okay, we're working on our service project. It's a fun one. So definitely check it out. Hello. So today I am making um, Christmas crack. And it's white chocolate melted over Crispix and rice check cereal, pretzels, M&Ms, and you can make this with anything you like in there. I'm talking like peanuts, any nuts, oh, so good. So right now I am stirring and melting some white chocolate morsels to go over the next batch. Okay, two batches of the Christmas crack is done. This one is just drying. This one I kinda mixed it up again, so some areas that were still wet are drying, and then I will put some in some bags as gifts, and then the rest we will just chomp on because it's delicious. Tell me down below, what do you put in your Christmas crack? Oh, okay, we just made um, split pea soup for dinner, and we had company over, so now we are ready to eat. And here it is, yay! So we're gonna dish up, I'm gonna take the ham bone out, and we're gonna have some split pea soup. Okay, I am bagging up some of this Christmas crack uh, to give to my girlfriends. What we did last year was a Christmas house tour. We would go and tour everybody's house, see the Christmas decorations. We just had some friends that we haven't seen in years pop over. So um, I'm not joining them, unless there's more houses after this. But um, the girls were on their way over to see our house, all decorated for Christmas, and I want to give them some Christmas crack so I'm gonna wrap this up so yeah um, I know you guys want to see some of the new things that I did not a whole lot has changed from last year but I'll share with you some of the new stuff so so cute so cute I love this decoration this is around all year round Derek has a funny story about the potpourri bags that he took to work. So he's just telling me how people liked them and yes. they're still brewing they're them. They're a great idea. Yeah. They worked. People really enjoyed them. And they last a long time. Uh, people just keep warming it up and smelling up the house. And I even had someone tell me, hey, this was great. We really appreciated it. My love, my wife, she she loved the drink mix. She she liked it. I was like, great! I'm glad she liked the drink mix. <laughs> so I guess the stove top potpourri, it's all edible, can be used as We're, a tea. It's a nice Christmas tea. homemade tea. So I'm gonna cook up another batch, and I'm gonna Test. taste it. Just to see. You didn't, you didn't have the heart to tell him, oh, it was potpourri. No, it says it on the bag. It does I, say it on the bag. I, it wasn't even like, uh, you drank it? <laughs> so, well, she liked it, so yay. <laughs> Battery was coming and being like really nice. Hey, she really liked it when she was like puking. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's the gift that keeps on giving Clark. My girlfriends are here, so I'm going to hurry and finish and give them their gifts. Good morning, friends. How are you? Well, we got snow last night. Serious snow. So, we need it here in Utah, and I hope it sticks around for Monday. I hope we have a white Christmas. Um, right now, I'm just packing up stuff for um, 
school. I'm meeting the kids at school. Um, Shaylee's birthday is tomorrow. Ah, seven years old. I can't believe it. And um, so we are, we brought in some cupcakes to celebrate her birthday so she can pass them out to her class. And we are make, it's her Christmas party at school. We're making gingerbread houses and she picked these chewy sour, like uh, sweet tarts to put on the gingerbread houses. Um, they went to the bus and they forgot to give their bus driver uh, her gift and it is a, like a little spa in a bag. Um, and so we'll bring that to the office and make sure. Um, they have their teacher gifts in their backpack. Shaylee gave a Bath and Body Works um, pack that I got on Black Friday. It has lotion, a spray, there's a third thing in there. So she's giving that to her teacher. Um, Boston gave um, his teacher and the teacher's aide some a Christmas crack. I'm going to give some to the front desk secretary and the principal. I absolutely love those ladies and mm, appreciate them so much. And then I said I would sign up to bring knives, plastic knives for the gingerbread houses. So that is that. Okay, everything's in the bag. My car is warming up. I'm just going to grab my purse. I think I'm out of gas and I should have filled my tank last night. So I need to leave right now. So I'm there on time for nine o'clock with a full tank of gas. Yeah, so. <sighs> Do you remember Christmas parties at school when you were a kid? They were so exciting. Like this is such an exciting time, you know, to be a child and I just try to keep those memories and create memories for them and keep that excitement in them because I have such fond memories of Christmas as a kid and school and oh. All right, I'm gonna get this in the car. I'm gonna go find my gloves though. Uh, they're in my bedroom and uh, yeah, start this day. Lots to do still, lots of last minute gifts I'm still working on. I'm working on a gift for Callie from Derek and I. It's almost done. Um, yeah, I'm excited about it so. It just makes me sad because it's a project that, oh, she's just growing up. That's all there is to it. All right, I'm going to go get my gloves and head out. So let's go party. Now I'm making the door with I just stopped into a jewelry store here at the mall and they cleaned up my ring and made it shiny again. Oh, uh, yes. Yay! Woohoo! We're getting ready for the birthday girl. All her gifts and her birthday cereal. We got her banner up and her balloons. Oh, she's so excited that it's her birthday. Whew! Well, being with Derek tonight was so much fun. We had a good night together. I am exhausted and I am gonna head to bed, but I am so excited to see Shaylee in the morning. I wish her a happy seventh birthday. This is crazy. She's growing up. So we have a big day tomorrow, big day for her tomorrow. And I'm so excited. So happy birthday, Shaylee.